congratulations, Scorpio people. Um, along with this new moon in Sagittarius, which is in your second house, what is it going to be like for your upcoming 30-day-ish period? So, um, the tarot results are just gleaming. It's really good for your money because, um, you know, this new moon is in your second house. So, second house is about money and resources, right? Mm -hmm. And let's look at also Jupiter. It's also in your second house and it's about to move on to, um, um, to, to the third house, which is in Capricorn. And on the 24th of November, there was just this um, Venus-Jupiter conjunction. And now, right now, Venus is already in Capricorn, but then right before Venus left and right before um, Jupiter is going to move on to Capricorn, they had a conjunction in your second house, okay? And now the energy is still there because there is this orb thing, O-R-B, okay? We call it an orb, an orb. So the energy is still there. And um, yeah, along with this um, new moon in your second house, oh, and plus Mercury is in your first house. So, what is it going to be like for you in this upcoming month? You are going to learn of some news and that is so beneficial for you for your money. So you're going to learn learn, uh, learn of some inside stories or just some, um, uh, we wouldn't say gossips, but just, just some uh, news from any, any people and that is actually quite informative and that's going to help you make money. For example, um, people tell you there are some job opportunities so you can go to apply for those jobs or they give you some tips um, as, as to like um, stocks and debentures and bonds okay and you know what are the good stocks to buy okay and then according to tarot but it is not that oh they just tell you the news and then you just um, gain money just right away right off the bat no you have to do some hard work. You have to do some legwork. So after you receive these, uh, this piece of news, you have to do some rule studying. You have to do some examination. You have to do some filtering. And if you really pay at least some effort, okay, pay some effort to it, you are going to benefit from that. So you are going to make real money. You are going to materialize this piece of news into real money. So this month is really... Uh, really good for um, good for good for your bank account. It's really good good for your wallet, as we we Chinese uh, as we Chinese always say. It's good for your wallet. It's going to make your wallet fatter and fatter. Okay, so you know what I mean. And the final tips for you is this: especially when you uh, receive this piece of news um, uh, around the middle of December. So um, thirteen ish, fourteen ish, fifteen ish. 16, 17 ish. Okay, so around this um, range of time these days, if you do receive um, the piece of like um, information within this range, uh, within this range of days, um, so it means that this piece of information is most likely to be true. Is it, is it, really um, it's it's not it's not just some um like um just some um, silly gossips or, or something like that. It's most likely to be true and. It's really going to help you, okay? It's really the what's what. It's some is is some really um real what's what of um of the financial situation or, or whatever, okay? That is going to benefit you. So please make use of this piece of news, especially when you receive it, um around the mid of December, yeah, mid December. So um, good luck to all of you and good luck to um to your bank account, to your wallet.